Hello Collective, hello Collective, how are you guys doing today? Hopefully swell and good. I'm going to pull out some signs and see what energy wants to talk to us about today. See whose energy pulls out. We're going to see what energy comes out, baby, Virgo, baby. Virgo and Taurus and Leo said, don't you forget me, baby, here I am. And Leo said, baby, who is one beside, oh God, it's a Scorpio and who underneath? And it said, a cancer said, that's who it is, baby. And what on a Taurus, Taurus said, there you go, Aquarius, baby. It's Aquarius and two more Aries, Aries and Libri. So, so hear what it's saying, it's saying. Digest and immerse yourself. Cultivate and collaborate with this person and shine and take action to investigate the things that others don't know of. And it brings balance. <laughs> That's how Spirit said that story, okay? That's how Spirit said it now. That's how Spirit said it. That's how Spirit said it now. Now let me get out this little card right here and see what it says. Okay, Spirit, what is Virgo need to know today? I'm using these cards. I like these cards. I've had them a while. I don't have my book in here, but... Okay, Virgo said, Sharon, the fairy man. I just did a read a while ago, and that same one pulled out on Virgo. What about Taurus? It's crazy. And I put that message up because it... Might have pissed off people. I ain't showed it. Ooh, Taurus Hathar, mistress of harmony, mediation, communication, culture. So you're leading others. You're like Hathar. What about Leo? Maybe there's a mistress, uh, a mistress that your Vir uh, that this Virgo might be steering towards. Ooh, did you hear that? Oh, and Leo Shine Danu, mother of creation. This is about motherhood, ferocity, creation. Ooh, this Leo is shining. She's a damn mother. She's she shows her ferocity. And Scorpio investigate set came out. This is the Prince of Avarice. This is about short-sightedness, ambition, narcissism. Ooh. So, someone is investigating that they have a narcissist in their mix. Ooh, that's what it is. That's exactly what it is. Hang on. What about cancer immersed? I'll read a little more in just a second. I'm trying to get them out first. Cancer fell on the floor and it's sad. Morgan Le Fay, the witch of the ages. Ooh, this is about taking atonement so you can grow. And then about the deceit. You got to talk about all the deceit and lies so you can grow. Witch of the ages. Cancer, okay. What about Aquarius? Aquarius. Aquarius, ooh, the prince, the forgotten adversary. Sorrow, lost valor, serendipity. So, someone, so maybe this cancer's been feeling sorrow and like she lost a battle with her, with her adversary. This could be um, a child or something. Aries act, Mother of Dawn, the emissary. This is about beauty, agency, compassion. Ooh. This Aries wants to take action and come towards you. They see you as very compassionate. They want to do something with me. Hang on a minute. 
oh god and uh Libra Balance said Thantos, Warden of Dis. This is about completion, support, expendency. See, uh, Thantos has a little butterfly in his hand. See it? Like it transformed. You transformed a balance. I'm going to do my cards to see what else this might be saying. Hang on. I, I made some new little cards. I'm gonna, I just got a few right now, so I want to... See what it says. What's Virgo need to digest at the moment? Hang on a minute. What's Virgo need to digest? They're counting sheep at night, trying to fall asleep. They can't stop thinking of how they wish they would have just opened up and not hid their love for you. Okay, Virgo? This is what someone is thinking about you or you're thinking about opening up your love to someone new Taurus oh someone feels burdened in their relationship they feel like they've been lied to but they're suffering of over a loved one who passed over and they can't let go of this loss they need to come to terms with the death and realize they're in their heart always so Taurus might understand that you've lost a loved one. They've been a lot of suffering in your life, and they know that that um, you're somebody who mediates situations, and you know how to communicate about these burdens. Okay, all right, Leo. Oh, there's a secret that's coming out, Leo. And the secret is someone loves you and they keep being pulled onto your path. Oh, ooh, Leo. Someone sees you shining now, Mother Leo. And they think you're very ferocious. And they fucking love you. So a secret is they love you. What about set for Scorpio? Scorpio Prince. Oh, Day of the Dead. Ooh. I don't know how to say it in, Me in Mexican, but I seen it the other day. Los Maretes, maybe someone um, practices that day or something. Or maybe they, maybe this Scorpio's investigating that this is a dead end relationship. That you got to cut the losses with this fucking narcissist. That's what people is realizing in your life, okay? What about Morgan Le Fay, which of the ages? Oh, which of the ages is cancer is uh, saying need to take atonement for their sins and um, so they can grow and not be stuck with this liar or in, in deceit of their own. And a lawyer wants to take your case and help you against your enemies. Ooh, did he hear that, Cancer? I'm trying to help you now. See, I have friends on here. I try to help us see what people said. Oh, what about Aquarius, the prince, uh, forgotten adversary, feels sorrow and lost and serendipitous. You are ready for this new growth. You're going on a new road that's leading you to your love from up above. Oh, Aquarius, you should feel serendipitous and stop feeling sorrow because you need to go on this new path. What about, who was this? Oh, yeah, Aries, mother of Dawn, Danu, uh, the emissary. Uh, agency is going to help you, okay? When nothing goes right, you need to go left. Choose the left-hand side. <laughs> Aries is want to take action to go left with you now. Libra balance, completion. Oh, Thantos Ward of this. Ah, oh, you got support from your spirit guides. Spirit guides you daily. Don't let others drag you down. See, spirit guides you daily. Ooh. I was just wanting to show y'all my new little cards. I just made a few of them. I'm trying to think. Hang on a minute, collective. No, oh, I don't want to do them. Hang on, I'm trying to think what to do, collective. 
Yeah, oh, 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 oh. to do collective, oh, baby. Here's what it is, collective. Let me do a little shuffle, shuffle time for you, babies. Do a little shuffle time for you, baby. What is for Virgo, baby? What is for Virgo, baby? Fell in the floor, counting sheep. Confidence, C -c confidence. Stand tall and stand proud for the one you love and open up and focus so you can transition, okay, Virgo? And so you can sleep. What about Taurus? Taurus feels burden in a relationship. They know somebody lied to them or th their person that they're wanting to be with, they know that someone's lying to them. They want to communicate to you. They want to cultivate a life with you. Uh, you need to set your intentions tonight. You need to set your intentions and uh, go towards uh, your goals and dreams. Set your intentions, Leo. There's a secret coming out. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's about adaption. Oh, you're being pulled on your path. You're needing to adapt to this new path and shine because you're a mother. You're beautiful, remember? You know how to bring life. Uh, you're very... This is about your creation. Ooh, you're adapting to this new life. I love that spirit. Oh, and Scorpio. Uh, they need to stop focusing on the day of the dead all the time. And stop living in this narcissistness. And stop having all this short-sightedness. And live in joy. But it's hard to teach a old dog new tricks. It's hard to do that. Cancer, oh, somebody's hunting you down now, Cancer. You're targeted. You got targeted by a Morgan Le Fay witch, okay? They want to immerse themselves in your life and take your growth from you. They better atone for their sins. You are down one, Cancer. Aquarius, you're ready for this new growth. You're going on a new road that's leading you to a to your love from up above and you won't feel in sorrow anymore because you will have gained your valor back. You got to have belief, believe in the impossible, believe that it's happening from up above. Oh, maybe you put it in divine's hands. Divine said, leave it. It's going to happen. Trust. Oh, rest. Now, Aries, Someone's needing to take a rest. See, you need to lay down and take a sleep now so you don't get karma. I see a little circle up there. Yeah, you need to rest, Mother. Get your beauty rest and go left. Ooh, okay. What about Libri? Libri balance. Spirit guides you daily. Don't let others drag you down. What was under her? I can't remember. Oh, yeah. Completion support. You got, you'll got you be supported if you complete out that cycle. Ooh, a Taurus wants to provide for you, Libri. Uh, Libra Taurus landed on. Oh, God. Maybe you know your twins for life, baby. And you defend your love to the end. Ooh, howdy, woody, collective. I hear you, collective. Hang on, let me... So, let me get some of my messages now. These might piss you off or they might help us. I don't know, but we'll see in a minute, okay? Spiritually, what about confidence? Open up the love to the one you love. Oh, so you need to... um. You can't sleep because you're partying hardy and too much, uh, Virgo, and that's why you're counting sheep at night, and you can't focus or transition. you got to have the confidence to stop partying. Are you listening? You can't be addicted to porn and shit if you're wanting to be in a spiritual community. I'm just helping you. Uh, Taurus, set your intentions for the one you love. Uh... I'm secretly watching your every move on your social media platform. I love the way you do everything seamlessly. 
That's why I mean pound star oracle. Uh -huh. So they set their intentions to watch you pound star oracle. This Taurus is. They want to cultivate up. Uh, they want to communicate with you. Ooh, I hear that. Oh, and Leo Shine, you got to adapt. That the secret is this person loves you, Leo. They love your shine. They see you're a ferocious mother, <laughs> and that might be your North Node you live in. And what did you? What does a Leo? What they need to adapt to, spirit? What? What did they need to adapt to, spirit? What? What is it? Oh, 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 West Virginia wind star goddess Pam brings spiritual enlightenment to others. Oh, I am a Leo North Node. I just said it. It's you. You're adapting to your new spiritual path. You're adapting to it. And uh, you're shining. And you know somebody loves you and they spy on you. You know exactly who the hell it is. It just said who it was. Oh, Scorpio, you're a joy. You're a joy. Oh, and what else? You got to have joy and stop being uh, living like dead and stop being narcissist, okay? You, you got to have the ambition to live for joy and not narcissism. You're feeling disappointed after all the shit that comes out. You see and hear what all this man was actually doing to you, Scorpio. You're going to feel like death then. I'm sorry, honey. It, I'm sorry. What about cancer? Uh, a lawyer is hunting you out. Oh, it's a wounded man, cancer, that you're going to have to go to court with. Ah. This enemy of yours is a wounded man, and uh, they live in their head. They numb themselves to porn, money, and power. They seek to control or denominate others. They repress their trauma and anger, and they justify their anger. Oh, and you, it, they, you might be connected to a Virgo wounded man since that pulled out up there. <laughs> uh, and Aquarius, believe, believe, what was it? Believe that you're ready for this new growth, and... Stop feeling that all is lost. This was about uh, an adversary of yours. You had to get through that challenge. Oh, look what pulled out. Believe that this Taurus, this Taurus is your true love, Aquarius, and that that's your divine masculine. And, uh, you know, you're you're both climbing that ladder to success, so believe it. Believe it. Believe that this Taurus is watching you, Aquarius. And if you're an Aquarius and you, th you love a Taurus, you better be hitting fucking subscribe if you're new. Because they're watching you and they fucking love you. Oh, and what was this? And I can't remember. Oh, yeah, Aries. When nothing goes right, you need to go left now. And you got to take your beauty rest. You're beautiful, remember? You're so beautiful now. Oh, gosh. This might be a very immature person who never learns their lessons. And they might have went around lying on someone's name because you didn't sleep with them. Oh, that's what it said now. Oh, God. And if you're in a chorus, you got a lot of Libra in your chart right here. As Taurus wants to provide for you. They want to provide for you. They want to support you. They feel wholeness with you and complete with you. They fucking love you. That's what it means. And and it's and it's uh in Libra the this this person that wants to provide for you wants to let you know it. You was targeted by these group of people, uh, cause they they thought they could be cause they thought you could be bullied your entire lives and not do nothing. To, but take it. And Spirit said, hell no, wrong. They ain't saw a strong woman like you. Oh, so they, you was targeted. What well, about party hardy Virgo? They're having meetings about this person and behind the scenes. They are, they're having meetings, uh, because they know, uh, this person is addicted to drugs and they don't have enough confidence to go after who they really love or want in life. Taurus, I love you, God. Look, I love you, Infinity. I secretly watch you on your social media platform. I love the way you do everything seamlessly. Pound Star Oracle made this. Set your intentions. If you love this person, Taurus, 
and you know they've suffered a loss, why don't you speak to them? That's how you need to communicate with them. That's how you need to do this. You all might be from different cultures, but they're setting their intentions to love you. They've loved you infinity. Look. <laughs> oh, Leo, West Virginia, West Star Goddess, bring spiritual enlightenment. Oh, the abuser is receiving karma for hurting you for many years. Oh, don't worry, Leo. The abuser is going to receive her karma for hurting you for many years. Scorpio, they feel like death. And you're going to feel like death when you hear what all this man did to you. You're finally saying, we're not going to take it anymore. You're finally telling this person, hey, I'm not taking this shit anymore. And having children is in your destiny. The divine wants you knows that your heart is pure and loving, so you're supposed to have a child. Hang on, let me let my dog out. Oh, oh, pee -pee. Yep, that's what it said, collective. Hang on, let me get a smoke and a drink. If y'all like how I do this, would you please hit like and leave a comment? Cancer, this wounded man, uh, a lawyer's going to take your case. Don't worry. They know you're telling the truth or something. Okay. Stalker alert. Yep, you got a stalker. Yep, you do, Cancer. It's a man, and they're targeted. you remember? Oh, God, and... Aquarius, what come out over here? Oh, gosh, someone wants to tell you how special you are, and they thank you for all the help you've given to this Taurus masculine. Uh, they're wanting you to live life to the fullest, and um, they they know that you're recovering from hurts that you've endured, and uh, and the and now people are seeing that you're not the same person, and uh, you're doing better than ever. They want you to live and dream big for them, baby. That's what it is now, Aquarius. And what about for uh, Aries? Somebody went around lying on your name because you didn't sleep with this person? Oh, they're, they're, uh, they're doing the law of attraction. What? They was immature and they never learned their lessons. They they went right instead of the need to go left. They had to rest and get away from that person, that woman. Mm -hmm. But they might be trying to attract you to them. Okay, Aries? Sometimes you gotta distance yourself from people. Take a step back and figure out what was the purpose of this relationship and what lesson needed learning, okay? Libra, and uh, I think you learned your lesson that these people, uh, the lesson was don't trust everybody because these people wanted to bully you your entire life. They uh, they know that spirits guide you and they, they, uh, they couldn't drag you down. That's what you learned. You learned that you could provide and support for your own self and that... Um, you have divine pure love. That's why Libra and Taurus come out together. Venus pure love. Oh, that's why it is collective. That's why it is collective. And, um, hang on, let me let this one out now. Come on, dumbass. So remember, collective, somebody is trying to, wanting to stalk you or something, it said. That's what this says. Spirit, what does Virgo need to know? What does Virgo want to say? This is hidden truths. Distance. Barrier separation space. There's a distance between you and uh, whoever you're wanting to go towards. There's a barrier put up. But you're never separated. You know that, right, Taurus? Mirror, reflection, shared feelings, you. See, they love you. They mirror you. Leo. 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 
You have a spiritual connection. It's a deep love. Your soulmates, you're unified. See, during the distance, you all share the same feelings. This is a spiritual connection. See how it all ties in. Scorpio, investigate. You're not going to take this shit anymore. You've been affected by this drama. This was an unstable person. That's why you felt like emotional whirlwind. You know it? And Cancer, this stalker, is a victim. They play the victim mode. They, don't, they never learn from their mistakes. They don't learn from them. And uh, who the hell was this one? Oh, yeah. Aquarius. 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 Hang on, it pulled out five. Aquarius. Running. Ghosting, disappearing, invisible. Maybe you've been ghosting people, Aquarius. and Or maybe you feel like this person ghosted you and you, you've been feeling invisible or something. What about for Aries Magnet? Aries Magnet, Aries Magnet. They're having an epiphany. They're realizing uh, what they've done to you. And they're realizing that they was very immature. And they had an awakening. They're having an awakening at the moment. Libra. Libra. This Taurus wants to provide. You set your boundaries with someone. You set your boundaries. You said no and you set your boundaries with this person. Um, for some reason you did. Now let me give us one of these and see what it says. Virgo, you're a performer. You express yourself creatively for an audience. You inspire others. Oh, you're a great performer. What about Taurus? You're a protector. You are a spiritual guardian who looks out for others and keeps them safe. Ooh, I like that one too. Leo. Oh, Leo. Leo, you're a messenger. You are an angelic being who brings divine guidance to those you are watching over. That's what you are, okay, Leo? And for Scorpio, you're a gatekeeper. You navigate the hidden realms and you got others to experience them. Hey. Cancer, cancer, cancer. You, uh, you are an artist. You have a special vision that you can realize while honoring your creativity in all of its forms. And Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. Which you move energy to manifest your desires through work with spells, nature, and rituals. I'm not a witch, so I don't know who that witch is. I, the only thing I do is cards. Um, what does it say? Aries. Ooh, lover. You create sacred relationships. You heal broken hearts, and you embody divine love. Ooh. Good gosh, love her, baby. What about Libra? You're a shaman. I have more Libra in me than anything. You move between worlds and bring knowledge and healing from spirit. Yeah, that's me. Oh, you know how to put up boundaries. You have to to certain people. Don't you, collective? Yeah, you do. You surely, surely do. All right, Collective, I love y'all, and I hope this helps somebody out there today. Um, maybe I should... Uh, here, hang on. Let me give you one of my one of these little cards and see what it says. Little card. Little card for Virgo. One little card for Virgo. One little card for Virgo. One little card. One little card for Virgo. 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 They don't want no players, and they wanted you to lose that on money in your business. Okay, one for Taurus, one for Taurus, one for Taurus, one for Taurus, 
one for Taurus. Can't stop staring at your work you do. It does said that. Hey, they can't stop watching you. Oh, what about for Leo? Leo, yes. It's the age of Aquarius. Oh, you're a messenger to talk of this. <laughs> Gatekeeper. Gatekeeper Scorpio. What was it? Scorpio, Scorpio. Uh, you better watch out, Scorpio. Somebody's doing masturbation spells, and they're playing the perfect part. They're just in it to win it with you. That's all. Okay? They're in it to win it at all cost. Cancer. Cancer. Cancer said this man eats their drug boogies. <laughs> that stalker eats their drug boogers. Ah, Spirit, you're so fucking funny. You know, love Spirit, so funny. Don't place judgment on others' lives. That's what somebody says. And Aquarius, you're magnetically connected. You're magnetically connected. And something's going to make you cry when you find out. What's what's a chorus gonna find out? What's chorus gonna find out? What's chorus gonna find out? This didn't make no sense. Hang on a minute. What's a chorus going to uh, find out? What's a chorus gonna find out? What's chorus need to find out? What's chorus need to find out? What is it? What's chorus need to find out? Oh, it's gonna make you cry when you find out that somebody else actually did. Suffer incest like you. It will make you cry. It'll be okay. Well, we can all get through it, okay, you all? Because y'all know I've lived through it. Um, Aries, you're, you have no contact with this person at the moment. Because they was in that young energy. You have no contact. Uh... And you're born with these gifts, baby. And Libra, your deceased son. What's deceased son wanting to? You're, you know. And shaman, this pulled out for me. I have all that Libra in me. It says that you can move between worlds and bring knowledge and healing from spirit. And what that saying is, you can talk to your deceased son in spirit realm, and I can. I can, and. And my deceased son said, You're, the landlord is spying every time you go out. They want you to know that. What else does the deceased son want me to know? What else? And for other Libras, that has a deceased son. They don't have to. Any of that other stuff can go with you, Libra. Okay? Just mark the rest of that, the deceased son part, if you don't have one. Nostalgia for you. This landlord uh, misses you. That's what it's saying. They miss you. They miss you, and um, I'm going to get two more up here for them signs. They didn't have any. What about Taurus? They can't stop staring at your work. What about, do you really love him or her? That's what they're saying. Do you really love him or her? What about Leo? Yes, it's Age of Aquarius. Yes, it's Age of Aquarius. Uh, Divine Masculine's coming to your rescue. He's going to whisk you away to a new state to live with him. It's someone who owns, like, the whole downtown or city. Ooh, did you hear that? Oh, God almighty. That's what it said now. And that's all I got collected. And if you like what I did, well, you need to help me and support my channel so I can get it going back around again. I love y'all, and I'm going to get off here. Please like, subscribe, and share our pieces. I love you guys. Remember, this is all... For fun. I don't know who it will relate to. I'm just trying to help the collective and give back. That's what I do. I need to get over 500. And that's all I'm going to say. So I can give some decks away. Peace.